Hey guys, so in today's video I'm going to kind of be touching on the whole orange lip, coral lip trend that is so big for this spring and summer. I actually first noticed this trend, or when this trend was going to be big, was around like fall of 2010s. And I love following makeup trends because if you wear the same neutral eyes, which I usually wear a neutral eye almost every single day, but if you wear the same neutral eyes and the same neutral lip every single day, then makeup can get really boring. I'm absolutely loving this trend. So this video, I'm going to show you all of my top picks for orange and peach coral kind of lips. Um, the trend is really orange lips, but I know not everyone wants to wear orange lips, or maybe it's not school or work appropriate. Okay, so I'm just going to start with the color that I have on my lips right now. It's called Vegas Volt Snack, and it's an amplified, so it's pretty bright. Also, I'm going to have swatches, but I'm going to have photos and stuff like that on my blog right now. Like, as I'm, you're watching this video, the blog will be posted, so you can go see how these look in photos, because photos are always different than videos, because the lighting is always a little crazy in my videos. So this is what it looks like. It's definitely... Orange, but the reason I really like this one, and I think it's wearable for all skin tones, is because it has like a coral side to it. Like it's not just straight up orange, which I'll show you one that is really, really orange and in trend. But I just took off that lipstick because I want to actually show you guys on my lips. I feel like that really helps you guys out a lot more. Next two are definitely more high end in the orangier shades. Um, they're both by YSL, and I love these. I have number 27 and number 15. And this one's more corally, this one's more orangey. So I'm going to show you number 15 first. I really like this one a lot. I feel like the more orangier tones do look better on lighter skin tones like myself. And corally shades look better on darker skin tones. I just feel like it complements me a lot more when I wear more of an orangey shade as opposed to a more corally shade. But I love them both and I don't shy away from any color on my lips. Okay, so that was number 15, and now I'm going to show you guys number 27. I actually see a lot of pink in here. It might be hard to see on camera, so check my blog for photos. Yeah, it almost looks like a hot pink. Weird. I don't know, but I really like it. I know the lights are kind of blinding, but I haven't worn it that much because... I don't know why, but I think I'm going to start wearing this a lot more. Really, really pretty color. Okay, now for a drugstore pick. Um, this one is the most intense orange that I have found. And I found that when I went to the drugstore to look for um, lipsticks in this shade for this trend video, um, it seemed like CoverGirl had a good selection and Revlon. Revlon by far had the best selection of corally orange lipsticks. By far. I think like L'Oreal and Maybelline and stuff had like hardly any at all. Um, Revlon is definitely the go-to section of the drugstore if you're looking for orange um, lipsticks. So this one is called Siren. It's from the Super Lustrous. This how the packaging looks. Siren. It is like a orange, like an orange crayon. Um, but I love that because this is really what the trend is all about, wearing like orange lips but I know a lot of people it's kind of intimidating and stuff so that's why I'm giving you all of these options that are completely following the trend. It's about this lipstick is that it does stain pretty well on your lips so you might want to put down some kind of lip base or um, chapstick or something first because it does stain your lips and I mean stain like the whole entire day I couldn't get this off my lips but I will show you this color. Yeah, but this one is definitely orange. Like in between an NC or an NW15 and an NW20 in MAC, by the way. So I'm pretty fair, and it works on me. And it's just going to look better the darker skin you have. Honestly, this is probably going to look even better on you. Um, but yeah, it's really orange and pretty, and I love it. So now I'm going to move on to the Corally Peachier shade. Embarrassing ringtone. This one is limited edition, so I hate to even show it to you guys, but it's a really pretty color. It's called Everhip, and it was from the Liberty of London collection by MAC. I wear this color a lot, actually, in my videos. So you can see how it's just a lot prettier, more wearable, um, but still perfect. Um, so it's not completely following the orange trend, but it's just really pretty, and definitely more like if you're going to school or you're going to work, it's going to look better. Um, and then maybe if you go out to dinner with your friends or do something at night, you can put the orange lip on. But I love wearing the orange lip during the day with like a sundress. <gasps> well, actually I haven't done that yet, but I cannot wait to do that. My next color is a drugstore. This one is by Revlon. It's called Smoked Peach. And this is how it looks. 
and it's matte so it's definitely I mean it's already a pretty wearable color um but it's matte and I feel like matte is definitely in trend too a matte orange lip is pretty much where the trend is at like if you want to go full force definitely mattify it or if you can't find a matte one like I couldn't you can always use like a translucent powder on your lips take the oil out of the lipstick but this is smoked peach but I do really like this color and I completely stop swatching. I always do that. Sorry about that. So just check my blog if you want swatches. Um, but I do really like this color and it's really wearable and pretty. I think it's look good with the gloss on top actually. But um, Smoked Peach is a great color and it's drugstore. And actually I just bought these yesterday. So the two Revlon lipsticks that I showed you. I bought them yesterday and it was buy one get one half off at Walgreens. So hopefully your local Walgreens store will have that as well. I think the total was like 12 bucks, So that's really affordable like six dollars a lipstick okay now my lips are just like raw this one is by far a must-have it is expensive it's YSL it's $34 but it's gorgeous if you don't want to follow the orange trend you want to follow the peach trend which I love peach I've been wearing this color for like a little over a year and it's so pretty it's number 13 peach passion I know the name of this one because it's my all-time favorite it's gorgeous the color might not show up correctly yeah I love it so those are my top picks for the orange, peach, coral, whatever kind of trend that you're going to follow this summer or in spring. Let me know if you like any of those colors or if you're going to try them out. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Let me just show you something. Um, this is pretty disgusting. This is what happens when you decide to um, wear every lipstick in a video. Yeah, it's pretty gross. And my lips really hurt right now too. I hope you liked the video and I'll talk to you soon.